Hey guys, welcome back. How's it going? Uh, I know it's been a couple weeks since I've posted anything. Honestly, I'm going through uh, a pretty hard uh, family time right now. I'll tell you guys about it later. But anyways, I'm really happy to be able to have a little bit of free time right now and put together a video. Uh, now this is going to be a build video. I haven't done a build video in actually quite a long time. Uh, I mean summertime, summertime, you know, I'd spend a lot of my time outdoors. Um, but archery season's right around the corner. I've been putting in my reps and I actually came across this wicked DIY um, limb quiver that I want to share with you guys. Super easy build. I built a prototype first. I'll show you right here. Out of... Uh, some foam puzzle pieces just see how my arrows are going to fit a lot of them i saw it was only for four arrows but i want to have five arrows my plan is to be bringing three broadheads and two judos out to the bush with me that way if i run small game i can also take some small game with me um so what i do recommend to do um now i built these to the specs of my bow your bow is going to be different so even if you took a piece of cardboard and you uh, made a template first to see how everything fit, that would work perfectly for you guys. Now what you are going to need for this build, very cheap, like I said, very easy. All you need is a flip-flop, well two flip-flops. Um, I actually got these up at Value Village for two bucks. I know some people say go to Walmart or all these places, but if you can get to a thrift store, you can pick up uh, even a used set for really cheap. I like these ones, they're really hard. Uh, rubber uh, so they should keep the form really well and then you're also gonna need a knife uh, maybe a ruler and other than that that's about it I mean like I said it's it's a pretty simple build super cheap build um, so I already built one one end of it so you can see right here now basically this groove right here that's gonna sl slide right through my limb so we'll be sliding that right through the limb and then I got the five arrows that sit here um, and then, you know, I split, split it open so they can slide in. And then I even chamfered these a little bit. Um, cause I noticed I didn't do that with that one. I think it's going to help the arrows go in a little bit easier. So yeah, so let's get to the build. Like I said, super easy build. It's going to be a quick build and, uh, hopefully it saves some guys some money cause, uh, limb quivers aren't cheap. And sometimes you just need to hold a couple arrows, right? Um, now, I might do another one in the future where I actually build a nice leather cap for it. But for today, there's going to be no cap on it. So if you are going to be running this, obviously, be careful. Broadheads are really, really sharp. And that's usually why most limb quivers have a cap on it. Um, but yeah, let's get let's start building. Okay, so first things first. Cut these straps right off. Obviously different flip-flops will have different attachment things so all right so now this is where like I said you would use your template and you would put your template down on this and cut it out uh, if you do it fresh for the first time I mean you just gotta have this far enough and you have to have the spread far enough so that your fletching and your arrowheads don't touch all right so since I already got one built I'm just going to place it right on top Take my pencil.
there we go. Now, as for the hole diameter, I'm actually using a a 1964 drill bit because it's one size smaller than 5 16 because my arrow shafts are 8 mil. If you want to go just one size smaller, then whatever your arrows are going to be. Now if you have a little sander or something, I just have a little bow grinder and actually I'm just going to clean all these edges up. So, I'll be right back. So there we go. I cleaned all the edges up. Cut my slits. So, I mean that's all there really is to it. It's pretty darn straightforward. Um, the only other thing I'm going to do is like I said, I'm just going to transfer these and look. Let's get this mounted. All right, so the particular bow I have here is the Black Hunter uh, Longbow. So very easy. So you can see I'm a right-handed shooter, so I'm gonna want my arrows on the right side of the bow. Now you can decide if you have a pattern, if you wanna leave the pattern up or pattern down. I might even camo tape these. And you want them to be a nice, nice snug fit. Oh yeah. So there I go, let's try it out. Here. So there we go. I got all five arrows on there did my last one I it was actually hit my thumb but not uh, not this time so like I said I got nice uh, spacing between the veins <coughs> holds it nice and tight so nice cheap DIY arrow rest or uh, arrow quiver so I'll show you I'll even take a uh, I'll even take a shot with this on you can see nothing moves absolutely nothing moves So, again, this is not for everybody, but for the bu budget conscious person like I am, this is wicked. I'm so happy about this. Let me know in the comments what you guys think of this. If you guys would do this to your own boo. Um, other than that, I said, if you're liking this content, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe at the bottom. We'll catch you guys in the next one. And I'm going to try my best to come, come out with another video a week. Like I said, right now, everything's just touch and go with my family, so... Taking it one day, day at a time, alright? Alright guys, we'll catch you guys in the next one.